Well, hi there. Welcome to Bill's workshop. This is where I do woodworking and lawnmower repair. Uh, today, what I'm going to do is show you how to cut down some ailerons that are used on a Grockner Speedy remote control airplane. Now, what I'm trying to do is bevel the sides of these so I get a little more um, motion and movement uh, in the ailerons. Right now, they're kind of binding because there's not there's uh, too much material in the way. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to rip these down. I got the blade at an angle for the angle I need. Uh, just just kind of skim cutting. And uh, I never uh, ripped balsa on a uh, table saw before, so uh, this may go horribly wrong, which is why I'm recording it. Um, yeah, not much more to say other than let me try it. Um, I'll do a little. If it doesn't look good, then I'll stop. You can always repair balsa pretty easily. So let's get to it. Safety first. You always want to put on your safety muffins and uh, your safety glasses. Okay, this is uh, going to be a little, little tricky. Got to watch my fingers. You may see some blood fly. Uh, we'll see. Wish me luck. All right. <laughs> cut really nice. No complaints here. It's just a regular uh, dull um, uh, two by four type uh, rough cutting saw blade. Did the trick. Uh, now this one's a little trickier. I got some filler pieces on here because I, I botched it up uh, when I was uh, I tried to do this by hand first with an exacto and Cut a little too deep into the wood, so I had to add some filler pieces to uh, fix my mistakes there. So, uh, be able to uh, hopefully have a cut nice and clean up and be good to go. So, here we go, aileron number two. Not bad. Good enough, I'll say. Um, got some excess here I'll just chop off with an exacto, but overall that's a uh, pretty nice miter. All right, that's how it's done. See you next time on Bill's Woodworking Shop and Lawnmower Repair. Yeah!